Wider to five. Now they'll go inside 50. This is the kick that's letting him down. Oh. Five backed himself, got caught. Aerobatics from Brooks. this. Umpire Jeff Dalgleish, this is. That's a great hang on tackle. Yeah, oh, that's dangerous. Oh, I think that's worth the free kick there. I don't know whether you put. Penalised for tunnelling somebody who's receiving a handball, though. Tony. Well, it's dangerous. Uh, yeah, I, I don't know what's called under the uh, under the act as such. <laughs> Whatever it is, it's a wonderful finish. That it was a push in the back, and, and that's he did no call doubt that. that was it. But now, yeah, but, but that was he, in the buttock, as you said. <laughs> but he lands on his back. Yeah. Now that comes under the heading for me of, oh, that looks too rough. But they're big fellas. Oh, yeah. Ibbotson. 55 metres out, kicks to the top of the square. There's a little nudge there from Padfield. It's been seen. Like in front, yeah. And it takes away your ability to jump, and that means the bloke right at the very back controls the issue. Didn't have to push it. 11 minutes into the second quarter, Pavlich is on the board, Dockers hit the front. Here's one of them though, Jacko. Mundy breaking free to Mellington. Stop, start, Crowley off a step. Oh, oh beautiful yeah. kick to Pierce. So the Dockers have only kicked two goals. This will be their third, and Clancy Pierce will have two of them if he's accurate. A little stutter to 50 metres. Oh, look at that. Bang! Sends it sailing through. Oh. And it's gone through three-quarter post height. You've been roosting it, don't worry what about a, that. What a great kick. I've got to say, Rally. again... Ooh, gee, that nice little roost here. He's quite explosive, isn't he? Yeah, it's, a, it's against Redden on De Boer, I think. So there's Hanley. It's a 50-metre penalty. It'd be a goal. And this will be a big lead for the Dockers. In the context of the game, they're in front by 10 points. Experienced umpire there, Brett Rosebury. He explained it. We'll have another look at it and let it run in a second. Mundy's back. Dockers in front by 10. Back to Dawson on the left boot. Centering kick is a good one. Beats everybody, though. Maguire in trouble. Zach Clark! Zach Clark, the unlikely hero, kicks the goal. You know what he did? He just followed the ball in, ran in with the fly to the ball, albeit from a different angle. He's second on the scene. Poor bounce to the bloke who gets there before him. Wouldn't base your career on that type of play, being second in into the forward line on a bouncing ball, but <laughs> he's taken the opportunity. Inside the 450, right. Mellington's got it. And can he finish with a goal? Well, we needed some class in this quarter. Now this youngster here, just take your time. Work. He's going. For the check side, left footer, right behind him. Oh, oh beautiful kick. Oh. We needed some class and we found some with Mellington. McGuire's got a tough one. Clark. Pierce from outside 50. Clancy. Well, he was on the overflow and he kicked it. You just thought you got it out, but uh, just a good clearance here and, um, you know, getting the ball forward. I just saw it here, Goose Maguire, Matty Maguire, ground level, at his toenails. Not the area that he wants it. Oh, no. <laughs> and uh, as soon as that turned over, Zach Clark. But you still got to finish from outside there, and Pierce puts his, well, nearly beyond, I reckon, Brisbane Lions, and left there, change their style. Dominating everything here, the Dodgers, yep. except they're not finishing with goals. Can Duffield do it? He's running hard. That's Around the corner goes line. Duffield. Goal. 29 in this quarter. Yep. This is, this is a domination without really putting it on the board. It's two goals. Yeah, that, that, the second goal, I reckon that one might break the backs of them. And they've been brave to now, but they can't run it out. Jacko, I hear your point. There's two teams running out the same game on the same oval.